what's up everybody tweaks here um in this quick video i'm going to show you how to add mass to your geometry lines in your object builders for your p3ds um it's a step that i totally spaced in all my in my other tutorials and it is very important so in your geometry lines when you create your bots for your geometry say for lettered gun um, you line it up with your gun kind of like I'm doing here but you know pretend that it there's a gun here I'm just showing you guys just a quick sample and then you'll have it like lined up with your gun get it sized to your gun around your gun um, same with like if you're doing a building a custom building or a wall or a sign or anything you just you're gonna make your geometry normally your your bots you're gonna select it and then you're gonna go to structure topology find components that way you'll have your component and then you'll obviously have your auto center property zero value now here comes the mass part so you're gonna want to go to windows make sure you have mass tit or hit alt m so that way down here at the bottom you will see mass so for guns usually i stick around 5.000 um buildings you can go like 10.000 just the bigger the bigger the object the bigger mass you're gonna have so once you have you enter it you hit apply then you'll see it gives these little boxes around and then that's it now your geometry has mass to it um, it's very important to have on all geometry just your geometry lines um, for buildings and walls and stuff like that it will keep zombies from just being able to walk through them even though you can't walk through them um, zombies would still be able to walk through them without the mass um, but it's just one of those things that's needed and I totally spaced it in my other tutorials. So I just wanted to make this quickly to show you guys how to do it. That's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions, you can feel free to join my Discord link below. And thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.